Hey there, this is Alex from Got Game CA, and this is me bringing in the horror block for August 2015. I'm not really going to talk much before the video, so let's just jump straight in and see what we have here. Oh, so right away, I guess I'll take out the shirt, I'll hide everything so you don't see what else is in here. Oh, yeah, okay, I know what this is. It's beetle juice. Can't say that another two times. Beetle juice, another one time. So this is actually quite nice here. It's made by Shirt Punch. Oh, you get a wee code here. Um, which actually produces some really nice high quality shirts that Nerdblock have been using a lot recently. But it's nice high quality. They're really comfortable fits. They are nice to wear, but let's move on. <laughs> Next we have a, a plush, a plush toy. Put your passion in play, oh, okay. I don't see how that corresponds. But yeah, a Friday the 13th plush toy. It's, it's nice, it's, it's stitching can be a wee bit better, but it's a nice toy. I'm loving the fact that this says the product is for ages 18 plus, you know, being a soft toy and most likely all kids under the age of 18, well not, not all kids, but the majority of kids under 18 have at least heard or seen his face at least once, but this being a stuffed toy I don't see how it corresponds to the movies at all. As for the violence and whatnot, this is purely just a fun little stuffed animal that I would happily give a child because if they're young enough they're not going to know what it is but I will and I will laugh so next <laughs> okay so this this uh, is part of the theme that the Grady twins from The Shining um, this is actually quite nice here it comes with Lisa and Louise Burns handwritten signature and I know they're handwritten and not printed due to the lovely certificate of authenticity here. The certificate, let's see if I can get this a wee bit better so you can actually read it with me. This certificate accompanies an item bearing the authentic signature of Lisa and Louise Burns. The actual signing of this item was in part witnessed by a member of Iconic Inc. management. So that's actually quite nice, um, I'll probably get that either framed or keep it tucked away in my collection of signatures. Don't know where I would rank it though. I've collected some really nice signatures over the years. What else do we have here? Oh, okay. This is quite nice. I'm not I'm not even going to share this one with you. I'm just going to keep this behind and hide it. No. It's a Blu-ray. Uh, Rise of the Zombies with Danny Torejo. Tra Trajo? I, I don't know how to pronounce his second name, but I actually quite like him as an actor. If you've not seen Badass, it's fairly humorous. Um, as a B movie, would it be classed as a boot? It's not an A-listed uh, cinema film or theatres, but it's still quite a good film. And this will be nice in my collection here. I, I don't know why they've blacked it. Exclusive combo pack? So, <laughs> uh, I don't know why this is covered. Maybe because it's branded. No, I'm going to unpeel this. I just want to see what it says. Oh. Okay, that totally did not work. But, it's revealed something. There's a Best Buy logo there. Okay. <laughs> the deed is done. <laughs> what else do we have here? The usual magazine here, or Rue Morgue, which are a nice wee candle to be kept up to date. Some interviews on oh, screen part. Ooh, what is this? Ontario. Ooh, Ooh Ontario. <laughs> some, uh, some ideas for stuff to do. Is that Elijah Wood? Oh, I'm not really fond of him. Um, yeah. <laughs> 
can't lose track here, I'm going to look at this later, but it's coming up to Halloween soon as well. September, oh, what? That's, that's pretty soon. So there's going to be some nice adverts coming in here, of course. You saw the, the Scream Park or Scary Park. What I do have, which is a wee bit disappointed here, is I'm missing an item. I'll show you this here. It's actually a notebook here. And I was looking forward to it because I have watched a couple unboxings. And I did want an up-to-date notebook which I could use and have some fun with but it's it's not in the box so I'm gonna have to send an email there that's kind of disappointed me but shit happens hope you like the unboxing if you want to see more click like subscribe follow me on Twitter just I'm, I'm happy you watched the video that's all thanks for watching take care